outside intro. It's still hot outside. I still wish there was less hot outside. It's so hot inside. It's so hot inside. I looked down at my pants and my balls were holding up a white flag. A white flag. They can't handle the seat anymore. They're surrendering. Mm-hmm. Is it? Are you in my turn? It's so stressful to get shiny pieces of cardboard, ain't it, right? It's so true! Oh my gosh! $91 Yu-Gi-Oh card! This one's a little later because I spent, like... I spent two and a half hours straight playing Yu-Gi-Oh with my best friend. And... Whoosh, that that card was worth it. That card was worth it. It was so fun to play with. Sometimes, guys, you just gotta use your cards and use your own means to make yourself happy. And that's what life's about. So I put in the random number generator for all my subscribers, including the ones past 700. And somehow, Dev Beggs Music got it. He must have willed it into existence because out of 700, he got it. And congrats, Dev Beck's music. You got that guitar pick you wanted. Now, get a hold of me at my Gmail. I made a post with you in it. Yeah, this is part of the seas. This is part of the. This is an episode too. Congrats, you made it onto the. You made it onto an episode too. Def Bags Music shout out. So, I hope you all are having a great day. You know what I need? I need some more animated me reactions. What do you guys think? I, I'm missing Metal Guy Effigy right now. It's going to be like a season, this season, the rest of the season ain't going to have him, sadly. I mean, not going to be near him. Not going to be near Tiki Guy or Metal Guy either. I'll be back there over eventually. I miss them. They're my friends. Well, here's your guy Devin here going to, you know, review some memes like I said I was. You know, because... I really like this segment. It's really fun. Oh my god. If y'all don't get that, that's Ratatouille with the pistol shrimp. Pistol shrimp could like punch a hole in a steel toe boot. Oh my god. That's just like Badlands Chugs mean mugging. That ain't even a meme, bro. Oh my god. Why'd they make Kirby so painfully thick? Like, look at that Kirby booty. I'm gonna tell my kids this was Tony Hawk. <laughs> yeah, classic anti joke here. Oh my god, Jar Jarby. I don't think I could do more, guys. Jar Jarby? What next? Darth Jar Jar? Best meme. I almost died once. Well, actually, almost died several times. But here's the time I almost died where it was beyond my control. And I think that, uh,. The taxi who almost ran me over stopped right there and then. I took too hard of a left turn on my bike and slid right into the middle of traffic and I was almost accepting that my life was gone. I was counting my prayer, I was tallying everything up. My life flashed before my eyes. The guy stopped, I'm like, Thank you. And he was so happy that he didn't hit me. I was... I was that close to death. It's called self-love. You do something for yourself, and you treat yourself good, so that you could treat others good. You know what I mean? Sometimes, like... It's better to make sure you're good so you can make sure everybody else is good. 
Because if you don't have a solid foundation to make sure everybody else is good, how can you make sure yourself is good? How can you make sure your everyone else is everyone else is good? How can you make sure even the things you need to do are good? <laughs>